Hey you guys, sorry for the delay. We had a bunch of rainstorms in the area. It got crazy. Um, I've got some exciting stuff for you today. I'm gonna turn it around and show it to you and then we're gonna walk around the corner and you won't believe it. All right. So as you can see, their drywall is up and they are getting ready to tape and bed and texture. So let me come in the front door for you and I'll give you a walkthrough. So there's the view outside the front of the house. Okay. So here we go, coming through the front. And these ceilings are really tall. I know it's really kind of hard to to see how tall the ceilings are but they're really nice they're really open there's the closet here's the bath sorry it's so dark in here guys hopefully the camera can lighten it up a little the tubs already in the drywalls up the reason there's water in the tub is there uh, pressure testing it for leaks. There's your window. And again, another closet. And then this is going to go right into the garage. Remember, it's right off the front door. Okay. Sorry if there's wind noise, guys. It's uh, The doors are open and the windows are open, so it's a bit drafty. Okay. So here's the garage. It's too wide, and then over here, it's the tandem, and you can see it gets kind of deep. Got all the drywall in out here. You can see the insulation is in. Now, they moved so fast, Chris, that we're only gonna be able to do an, an inspection at final, so meaning about two weeks before uh, would close on the house and that's okay nothing wrong with that and it's actually less expensive than a two-phase inspection okay guys so let me hush look at this look how pretty this is isn't that gorgeous that is just really pretty okay and then here let's go down the hall okay there's the utility room Got another bedroom back here. This has got the bath on it. Can't get over how pretty this is. And there's not a single light working in here, guys. This is all just natural illumination. And then now we're in the kitchen, okay? So let me just kind of sweep around. Just looks gorgeous, doesn't it? Here's your pantry, okay, right here. And then this right down here, this is where the island's gonna go. And remember, the island is gonna be looking out like this, okay? Now this is where, I, remember, this is where I walked into the house today. So there's your back porch, the covered porch. And you know what, Chris, we were thinking we needed it a lot deeper but that's still a pretty big porch and it still gives you a nice backyard. Okay, here's the master. Now look up there, look how grandiose that's gonna look. Nice big master, right? And then there's the windows into the backyard from the master. And then here's the tub. There's the shower. 
Okay, there's the facilities right through there. The shower is just going to be really cute. And then back in here, we've got big closet, linen closet, smaller closet. All right, guys, I hope that was a really nice update. And I got to tell you, when John told us they were moving and going to have four months to build this house, I didn't believe it. But they are moving very quickly. They've already passed the mechanical rough out, which is the pipes and the electrical stuff that's in the walls. Um, they've already got the insulation in, the drywall in. They're bricking it right now. The fireplace is set. I mean, Perry Homes is flying and they build a good quality home. Um, so I've got about an hour's worth of work here. I've got to sign off of this video and I've got to go walk around and poke my nose in all the corners and look at stuff and just kind of make sure everything's coming together properly. Um, please ignore the mess. Do not worry about all the trash on the ground. That's part of the construction um, process, if you will. They, to build stuff, it gets messy. You cut a two by four, you have some pieces left over. So don't worry about that. They're gonna clean all that up. They're gonna have this finished bricking. It usually takes about three days for a house this size. And then it's gonna be bricked. The roof's on, the windows are in, the drywall's up. Now, guys, remember, so this is just smooth drywall. This may be, I think, Chris, what we talked about that you were used to, but everywhere there's a seam, they're gonna put some tape. Then they're gonna put some texturing on here and it'll have a nice uh, texture to it. And then when they paint it, it, it helps dapple the light. So any little imperfections are hidden and it looks really nice. I think you guys will enjoy it as a neat little difference in homes down here. And this is really coming together quick and it's gonna look gorgeous. I'm super excited for you guys. All right, please let me know if you have any questions. Um, of course, John's available to answer any questions as well. And other than that, I will see you guys next week. May God keep and bless you and your family and cause his face to shine upon you. All right, guys. Bye.